previously on Eve. Dinner Friday at 8? If you insist. <laughs> now, Shelly seems sweet enough, but the low-cut dresses, the tattoos, your father and I have worked too hard and sacrificed too much for you to settle for a girl like this. She is not what we want for you. Hey, I might not have gone to college, but I got a PH double D. Very pretty apron, Shelly. Thank you. You know, actually, it's a family heirloom. My grandmother taught me how to bake in it. You might want to take the price tag off your heirloom. <laughs> so, has fight started yet? I, 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 what's the password? Free beer. Close enough. <laughs> This is going to be the best dinner dance that the Lynx Social Club has ever had. Of course, it's probably because I'm the new president. Uh. <laughs> well, thanks for inviting me, Mrs. Hunter. Oh, don't thank me, honey. My reward will be in heaven. <laughs> well, I'm really excited about going. What should I wear? Well, it's black tie. Uh, but you've got such great taste. I'm sure anything you wear will be just fine. But um, you might want to give the cleavage the night off. <laughs> I'm sure Shelly will be the prettiest lady at the dance. <laughs> Besides you, my dear. Ready to pull it out of the fire, Dan. So can I get the details on your date with Donovan last night? It wasn't a date. Liar, liar, thong on fire. <laughs> it was no big deal. We just had one kiss. <gasps> Ooh. I promise you won't say anything. I promise. <laughs> Shelly, I need to talk to you. <laughs> About the weather. <laughs> nice shot. Hey, guys, I got a bit of a situation here. Was there DNA evidence involved? <laughs> Forget that. Were there any pictures? <laughs> <laughs> no, listen, I'm serious. Last night at the Firefly Ball, <clears throat> I had a few drinks and I accidentally kissed Rita. Well, what happened? You tripped and fell on her lips? I don't know. I feel kind of awkward now. I mean, should I say something to her? Nah. I mean, she's probably just as weirded out as you. Besides, you know, that conversation can only end in crying, yelling, or a tennis bracelet. Nick, the fight's coming on. Quit flipping around. Hey, that's how wars start. <laughs> just come to the fight, please. Yes, those sexy girls have gone wild again. This time, they're in the fall. What is this? Just some tacky young girls flashing for the camera. <laughs> no home training. I got a PH double D. Rita? <laughs> what did you do? Those are nice puppies, but these are the big ones! Jamie? <laughs> I smell smoke. Everybody out of the house. Come on. Save yourself. <laughs> Shelly. <laughs> Just like me. <laughs> oh, she's the kind of chick who likes to look fly. Can pick up any guy with a slick rap line. Give him the eye, get the keys to the ride, and live the single life, little teasing on the side. <laughs> she's the type of chick who likes to wear fly clothes. It rocks the lead toes, but we'll get get told. If anybody knows, I'ma tell you who knows. Who spin the cash flow? Let the story be told. Come on. EVE. How you do that? EVE. How you do that? I still can't believe you wound up on Girls Gone Wild. First of all, that was not me. Well, it was Rita and Janie. Yes, yes, it was. And I intend to chastise them firmly embarrassing me in front of your parents like that. Would you give it up, Shelly? That was you. Okay, let's just say it was me. I not that it was. <laughs> but if it were, is it really that big of a deal? Yes! <laughs> Good thing it wasn't me then, huh? Do you, do you think that I am stupid? No, I think you're smart, funny, and very forgiving. <laughs> I love you. <laughs> you complete me? Stop it. My parents are really upset they couldn't get out of here fast enough. You know, my mother rolled down the driveway. And I'm really sorry about that. What made Slow Joe think she could jump the hedge? 
Never mind my mom. We're talking about you in that video. I hope you realize this mess is all your fault. What? what? Yes. The only reason I was even at that club was because you were out playing basketball that night instead of celebrating our three-month anniversary with me. What difference does it make where I was? If we had been together, this never would have happened. Oh, you're right. You're right. I'm, I'm, I'm so sorry. It's all my fault. Don't beat yourself up over it, baby. I forgive you. Woman, you have lost your mind. That was hurtful. I think we need to discuss how you talk to me. Well, no, don't try and flip it. I saw you with my own eyes. That was not me. She like... keeps saying it wasn't her, but it sure looked like her. Nick, it was her. Damn, she Johnny Cochran good. <laughs> well, it looks like we're stuck in here. So, what are we gonna do? Well, let's see. We've been together for six weeks. I can think of one thing we haven't done yet that might be fun. Sex? Yes, please. Are you hinting? No, I'm begging. All you had to do was ask. Damn. I thought of everything but that. <laughs> it's not all gonna be that fast, is it? What you talking about? I'm already done. Help you with that. Mm. Mm. Oh, that's good. Mm. Eric? Please tell me Eric is your mom's name. Oh, no, that's just my own boyfriend. He tattooed his name on your shoulder? Yeah. That's so cute. <laughs> I just, I just remember. What? I can't have sex. I, I got a, an audit to do tomorrow. Well, you want me to leave? Yeah, you know, I can't go on this way just with a smile on my face. I can't do that. Just... Uh, drive safe. <laughs> I'm awake. Sleeping on this bed of nails you should have told me not to buy. Well, you only have yourself to blame for that girls going wild video. <laughs> Can we please not start this morning? I said I was sorry. Janie, sorry's not gonna cut it this time. Lately, you've been running around like you were on spring break with your two live crew. <laughs> It was one little mistake, I promise. It will never happen again. Yeah, damn, Skippy. <laughs> you need to start acting like a married woman. No more hot catting around with your fast-ass friends. <laughs> now, I'm laying down the law. You can go to work, but no socializing. No more phone pits and no drinking with the girls. Because if there is, it's going to be morning going wild up in here, up in here. <laughs> These girls gone wild videos are selling like hotcakes. I had to fight a couple of teenage geeks for the last copy. Now my hands smell like clear as <laughs> Cover. I can't believe this. Neither can I. I mean, my body is much better than yours. <laughs> How come I didn't make the cover? Think about it. Do you want to be on the cover? Well, no. But then I saw her on it. <laughs> Rita, you need to get a grip. And by the way, don't so, hey. <laughs> Girl, sit your frail tail down. <laughs> Man, this is a mess. JT went off on me hard last night. We fought until four in the morning, slept two hours, got up and fought some more. Well, at least you got some sleep. Marty put me on the couch and on punishment. <laughs> he can't do that. He's not your daddy. I can't say anything. A while ago, I put him on punishment for sneaking off to a basketball game. He didn't get dessert for a week. And I mean nothing sweet. <laughs> do you think this punishment's gonna last? I don't know. You know, Marty's all talk. I give him a couple of days, but in the meantime, I'm not supposed to hang out with you sluts. Sluts? I know you 
are not blaming us because your butt hit the phone first. Uh, Preach, sister friend. Uh, <laughs> and Rita, we all know it was your fault for dragging us to that college bar. Dragging you? Mm -hmm. If you hadn't been whining about your stupid made-up three-month anniversary, I'd have been home with a good book like I always am. You mean the phone book for your liquor delivery? <laughs> You know what? Marty's right, and it's high time I said so. Y'all are just too wild for me. What? Excuse me? You Hello? Hello? I need a signature for this, please. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Look, you know what? People look different on TV. Nobody's gonna recognize us. It's a blowover before you know it. You Thanks, and uh, by the way, I love your work. Thank you. Um, would you like to buy something? Sure. You got any more videos? <laughs> and there it was in big fat letters right on her shoulder. Eric. I felt like I was the second man to walk on the moon. <laughs> well, you need to get over it. She has a lot of tattoos, man. And one of them's of this, this weird Siamese cat. Its eyes are always staring at me. <laughs> So I just stare back. <laughs> I don't know, man. This is major. Hey, it's not like Danny exposed herself on national TV. <laughs> yeah, I'd be in therapy behind that mess. <laughs> I mean, uh, stay, stay strong, bro. <laughs> Dad, Mom, uh-oh. <laughs> um, how's the ankle? Throbbing, thanks to you. Yeah, I didn't tell you to jump that hedge in heels. <laughs> Andrew, talk to your son. Son, your mother's not happy. You can just guess how I feel. <laughs> Honey, we have to talk about Shelly. Oh, Mom, come on. You may think I am out of touch, but I know all about at-risk inner-city youth. I've seen Cooley High. <laughs> all right, look. I'm not even going to try to defend what Shelly did. It bothers me, too, but I care about her. And I'm not going to break up with her over it. Fine. But I hope it's understood you are not bringing Shelly on Saturday. The Lynx is a very exclusive organization. It's a dinner dance, not a lap dance. <laughs> Ouch, Francis, that one hurt me. Andrew, I'll be in the car. This time, walk around the hedge. <laughs> Yeah, I'll be paying for that one. God, Mom can be so judgmental. Yes, she can, but she's not always wrong. Oh, come on, Dad. You've always liked Shelly. Still do. But there's something I need to say. It may not be what you want to hear, but it's got to be said. Okay, I'm, I'm listening. Son, there's girls you date and girls you marry. That's it? No need to talk it to death. So, you sure you're up for this? No more audits? I cleared off my desk so we can get to work. <laughs> what? What's wrong? Nothing. Nothing. It's all good. <laughs> Johnny? Who the hell is Johnny? What? On your back. Oh, my tattoo. Apparently part of a match set. <laughs> Got Eric on your shoulder, Johnny on your lower back. Anybody else I need to meet? Yeah, I'm just uh, blaring on my hip. <laughs> Damn! <laughs> Couldn't you just get a palm pilot? <laughs> Look, these were all guys that I loved. Each of these tattoos was a romantic gesture. So send them a basket from Hickory Farms. Everybody loves summer sausage. <laughs> Nick, I didn't live in a convent till the day we met. I have had a boyfriend or two. Or three. Don't forget Larry. <laughs> You've had other girlfriends. I mean, didn't you keep mementos from those relationships? Yeah, in a box under my bed, not on my ass. <laughs> okay, you know what? I'm gonna go home, because you seriously got some issues that you need to work through. Oh, you got a body by Etch-A-Sketch, and I've got issues. So, 
kind of dressed up for the regular Z loungers, aren't you? <laughs> no, I always look good. And I think that's pretty common knowledge. <laughs> well, it's also common knowledge that Donovan's favorite color is blue. <laughs> Look, Shelly, Donovan and I are just friends. More like kissing cousins. <laughs> Hi, ladies. Hi, Donovan. Dude, what's up? Dude. <laughs> it's good to know, sport. Ow. What's going on to you? Nothing. Go get us some drinks, buddy. I think you may have had enough. <laughs> Damn, if you were a guy, you'd be gay. Look, it was just one little kiss. I kiss people all the time. It doesn't mean anything. Really? Yeah. Whoa. I love this job. There. I kissed the bus boy, and we're not in love. So, so much for your irresponsible insinuations. I'm going home. Bye, Donovan. <laughs> Bye. Hi, yeah. <laughs> Shelly, we need to talk. Okay. All right, enough with your okays, okay? I got something I need to say, and I'm gonna say it, damn it. But first, let me just say I've been doing a lot of thinking, and I'm just sick about that Girls Going Wild video. So am I. Which is, I mean, what you did was unac unacceptable, irresponsible, and completely embarrassing for you and your family. Yeah. You said that good. JT, I was wrong, and I'm really sorry. Okay, then. I guess it's about everything I need to say. <clears throat> I'm sorry to be so rough on your baby, but. I had it coming. Exactly. <laughs> Thank you. Now, um, the other thing I need to talk to you about is the Lynx dance. Oh, I'm so excited about going. I got a new dress, ultra conservative. Your mother's gonna love it. So trust me, you'll hate it. <laughs> yeah, but, um, bad news, baby. We can't make the dance. My boy Ralph decided to get married next week, so the fellas and I are gonna throw him a bachelor party tomorrow night. Do you have to go? Yeah. I'm sorry. I, I know you were really excited about the dance, but I just can't let Ralph down. Aww, I was just really looking forward to seeing you in Black Top. Oh, well, I can go home right now. I can try my tux just for you. Oh, no, no. Not the tux. Uh -huh. Just the tie. <laughs> Egan's Admiral. <laughs> oh, come on, Marty. I mean, to speak freely, sir. Denied. <laughs> now, Janie, I will be back at 1300 hours to collect you for lunch. Yes, sir. Girl, that man is wearing me out. Do you know that fool woke me up at 5 o'clock this morning? to do some calisthenics, talking about I need some discipline. <laughs> Janie? Huh? Let's make lunch at 1330 hours. Okay. Ooh, he almost got me that time. <laughs> Girl, how are you dealing with this for a whole week? Sooner or later, he's gonna mess up. And when he does, it's on. The Admiral is gonna meet the Commander-in-Chief. <laughs> Here. Hey, Yvonne, what can we do for you? Well, I brought you guys some flowers to thank you for the beautiful dress you made me. I was the hit of the Lynx dinner dance. Oh, we're glad you liked it. Yeah, tell all your friends, especially the ones with money. <laughs> <laughs> I can see you're back to your old self, Shelly. Glad to know you're feeling better. Feeling better? Yes. I ran into JT at the dance. He said you were sick and couldn't come. <laughs> oh, yeah, um... It must have been one of those 24-hour things, you know, Hong Kong bird, a cruise ship flu. Um, I'm feeling better, though. <laughs> good, good. Well, I've got to be off, but thanks again, ladies. Oh, bye, <laughs> bye, bye, bye. Bye.
JT told me he wasn't going to that dance. But he did go without me. 